Hello guys, how are you? In the previous uh, tutorial, we uh, draw our um, game character to uh, blend with our um, uh, game background. So this time around, we need to animate our game character with another, um, what you call this enemy, to blend with our um, game concept design. So I'm using the Adobe old version of CS6 because I am very comfortable with it. At the same time, it is light and, uh, you know, uh, well, I, I like it. But um, later on, if you want to use the new version of Adobe uh, CS6, you can uh, download the Adobe uh, CC Animate version 2021. Now let's start with our, uh, let's start continue other with our lesson. Um, here, I will add another layer. The purpose of this layer is to um, draw another character for uh, this um, game concept design. I have here the sphere. At the same time, I'm using the basic principles of you know of the of the circle to uh, design my um, character. So I uh, use the sleeping and standing line to uh, proportion my drawing. And as you can see, I'm um, you know uh, illustrating the villain in this game uh, concept creation. Um, so the purpose of using this gray color, uh, this will serve as my guide and, uh, you know, I will, uh, uh, clean it, this up using another layer and to clean this up, no, uh, my favorite tool in this, uh, um, drawing tool of the, uh, Adobe CS6 is the pen tool. Okay. So you can use the technical drawing here by using the line, or maybe if you're comfortable with it, uh, by using your, um, pen or graphic pen tablet you can use the freehand draw, okay? So let's start now to draw, okay? I'm drawing now the horn. So we have here the horn, and then we start now to, you know, um, draw the detail of this uh, villain as character to this game concept design. And uh, later on, uh, we will color it, and we will uh, extrude the expression by doing some um, extra movements. Uh, we'll add more frames to this. Okay. So, please uh, stay in this channel. Now, we finish this drawing and uh, we need to clean this, this up by uh, deleting the layer for uh, for our uh, sketch drawing for this villain. So, we need to clean this up and then arrange these lines. At the same time, we need to put another color. So, we're using this layer to uh, clean this drawing and uh, let us fix this first now you can create your own character at the same time use your imagi imagination um you know you, you need to become wild no? <laughs> in your imagination to uh, draw this character so we need to color it up so i'm using different types of colors so that it will blend to my um, background and uh, of course use your imagination no? try to experiment i'm using blue and red and of course i have the purple and uh, of course uh here um the pen tool the size of my pen tool is 1.85 so that's how i uh, size my um drawing uh, tool okay i will now convert this to uh to a graphic object the purpose of the graphic object is where i can um dissect it later on to create the actions for my animation and at the same time i can um, also put this in another layer where I can morph this in another um, file to convert this an, as an object or a, a movie uh, clip uh, so that I can write codes and control this in the game room. So there you have it. So I have now uh, my uh, character. Let us exaggerate now our drawing. Okay, so we have here the villain, the devil uh, character. So. If you want to exaggerate this, always remember that uh, we will follow the basic steps in animation. We convert this drawing as a graphic file, as a graphic object. So the purpose of this graphic object is just like a raster file really in. We can dissect each moment of this uh, file, uh, of this drawing, uh, into uh, different frames. So here, uh, I will create different frames to my um, graphic uh, object. So let's say the standard frames per second is 24 to 31, but mine here is 12 frames per second. So that uh, the uh, movement is not that fast. And at the same time, it will blend also to uh, the actions of my uh, uh, character. Now, uh, you know, just imagine if you are drawing this in a band paper. Here, I am just what you call this, adjusting the actions and then uh, liquefying the size, the drawings of my character, tilting it to the left, okay? And then I will tilt it again, tilt it to the right. You notice that the frames are so many. But again, in the next next video, I will explain that. 
Now, after that, what will happen? I have already stored the different uh, behavior and frames to my uh, character. So, if I run the program automatically, you can see that there is already a dynamism of movement to this uh, devil character. Okay. So, I have here the, the CU drive, the CU, uh, what do you call this? Layer. Okay. This is where I put my character. Now, I will check my library. So, the library is where you uh, store your uh, graphic object and your movie clip object. Okay. So we need to um, tweak and check or tweak my drawing. Okay. I will uh, replicate this drawing. Okay. If it is already converted to a graphic object, then you can replicate it. You can copy it. That's the beauty of this program. Okay. The beauty of digital animation is really great. No? Uh, you can even uh, uh, do your animations in less than 60 seconds. No? So now I am now... Um, distributing this uh, devil character no so i have now the three devil characters right here okay and we'll add it an, uh, another okay i'm just uh, copy and pasting it and i'm sure that you know how to use the control c as copy and control v to paste your character now um always remember that colors in game design concept is very important i think we have a not uh, um, good action right here in the animation. I mean, in talking to the uh, action, to the movement of uh, this uh, main character. Okay, I forgot to uh, adjust the position of this character, so I think I will copy the original uh, uh, frames so that it will go back to the previous position. Okay, now. Let's just check. When we run a program, all right, that's it. You have now the prototype of your game concept project. Okay. This is now the example of your uh, game concept design prototyping. And in our next next video, we will uh, discuss how to write a program. At the same time, how to use the game engine um, scripts for um, uh, Adobe uh, Plus or maybe. Um, you can use also your uh, Adobe uh, CC Animate 2021 for this prototyping. And uh, okay, chill and enjoy. Please don't forget to share, like, and subscribe in this uh, channel. Thank you so much and uh, happy drawing.